One of the big complaints about a lot of the vintage Japanese sewing machines is that they're left position only. Now, if you use this particular straight stitch foot, which is in fact a zipper foot, and I will show you all the details, you will never even notice the difference. It just looks like you're sewing in a straight line. Could be center, could be anywhere. The only time you need to worry about it is if your stitch width changes, in which case all you have to do is put on a magnetic seam guide, which you can adjust and ignore the, the markings on your foot. And if you then line it up correctly, that is now set for 5 8 So if I needed to sew a 5 8 inch seam, I don't have to do anything special, I just follow the foot. The only time it gets a little strange is if you continue to use the zigzag foot. If you do that, then you realize you're sewing on the left hand side, but if you change it to the straight stitch foot, you won't notice the difference. I just thought that would be rather interesting for you to see how you can feel a little more comfortable with a left position sewing machine. So I've had, this is actually a needle adjustable, it's a Singer 237, it's adjustable needle position, but I am sewing in the left hand position at the moment because I have a straight stitch plate that I haven't put on yet and I just want to make sure because I'm sewing just two layers of uh, shirting cotton thicker than broadcloth, but it's still, you know, just 100% cotton. And all I'm doing is, this is for piping, so I'm just sewing the edges down so it feeds better for my next video, when I will actually put the piping on a shirt. This is a delightful machine, I must admit. It is really nice to sew on and I'm quite you know rotary hook oscillating hook if they're quiet enough smooth enough then I don't actually care so much except for certain things where one might be a little better for something over the other but considering I have a fairly substantial selection of machines both um, oscillating and uh, rotary I can just choose accordingly, but what I'm doing now, this machine is going to do a beautiful job. So I'm going to move the camera into the front of me, which would be a little more awkward to sew, but you get to see how it just looks perfectly normal. Okay, so I'm gonna try. Oop, I'm gonna try and hold this as steady as I can. You can see it doesn't look strange at all. Just sewing away normally, but I'm on the left-hand side. So if I move right in front of me, you just you wouldn't know. It makes no difference. So that's nice. It's it gets a little more complicated with certain types of feet, but this does make it feel more comfortable. You just can't tell, whereas normally it would feel a little uncomfortable. So you can see I'm I'm at the left-hand side if I do the hyperextension I'm on the left-hand side there. So hopefully that will help encourage a bit to not be quite so bothered about this. So let me show you how this foot actually looks. It's a zipper foot, however it's got a design that's very much like a straight stitch foot but with those notches on the left and right side of the zipper so it's a really great invention got it off of eBay I think shipped from China probably 
but you can be able to find them somewhere but it's really really good and totally adjustable so if you want to sew in the right left center or even slightly left of center like some of the Kenmore's you can adjust it as well